Good day ladies and gents, good day ladies and gents, I'd like to welcome you to my channel, my name is Dio Sebonga Bangala guys, today uh, we're gonna focus on your CFS N4 guys, CFO and C CFS N4 guys, for those who are still new guys, please subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell so you can be notified when I post a relevant content guys. Okay, guys, uh, this is our question paper. I'm done with your general general balances, inventory balances, and your source document. All of them, guys, I'm done. So today I'm going to be focusing on your 14.4, especially your suppliers journal and your suppliers allowances journal, guys. Please do not uh, confu confuse yourself, guys. Uh, there's your supplies channel balances guys and this is this is your supplies channel and your supplies allowances channel guys okay uh, maybe some of you guys might get confused guys but, uh, what do we record under your supplies channel okay under your supplies channel guys you're gonna record uh equipment or trading stock that we bought for the business especially for equipment guys that we bought for business not we didn't buy this equipment to sell it but we bought it so we can use in the business guys then a the next question might come up with how do we see or how do i see a stock that uh, was bought to be used in the business guys it's very easy guys already when you let's say you're writing your exam or your test is fine guys uh you're gonna have your inventory list guys where they will tell you that uh in this business this is a stock guys you have on the shelves or, or, st or at the storeroom to sell it guys but if you can get a supplies invoice guys with a different trading stock or a different stock guys to your inventory list if you can have a supplies invoice guys ne? Uh, with let's say like you have a laptop to be, to be uh, for an example guys a laptop ne? then under your inventory list you have like let's say super clues stick, but you don't have a laptop guys just know that a business bought that laptop to use in the business guys then that laptop will be recorded under your suppliers channel if we have to return the laptop to our supplier guys we're gonna prepare a suppliers allowances journal hope i'm clear guys hope i was loud and clear guys but anyway for you to get what i've just said please go back and repeat this video guys okay let's process our suppliers channel guys as you can see it's 10 marks guys okay where do you get the information okay under page 8 okay as you can see this is your suppliers invoice guys but we're not gonna do your campaign we're gonna focus on your Station stationary as you can see guys we're working under your officer stationary this here under this invoice we are appearing as a customer of statesman stationary guys yes really we are a customer to statesman stationary just because we bought this to use in the business guys please very simple guys okay we have your vet number and your invoice now in invoice number your telephone uh customer details uh name of the supplier address of a supplier terms date description this is, this is our stock where we bought to use in the business the amounts and the total guys okay cool let's go to our system Okay, cool. We need to open the relevant company, guys, which is of that stationery. Okay, of that stationery. Okay, open. Okay, your password. Uh, 
Remember, each process, guys. You need to go to process, process, channels. We're going to suppliers channel. Okay, we need to okay, let me uh, delete each and everything here. Delete. Oh, just wanna okay, delete, delete, delete. 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 Okay. Guys, we now under your suppliers channel. Please go to your settings before you can even process, guys. Make sure your text is activated. Inclusive, guys. As you can see, voice is say inclusive amount, guys. Inclusive text. If we were recording your suppliers channel opening balances, guys, we are going to deactivate the text, guys. But since we're doing your supplies invoice for the stock we bought to use in the business, guys, make sure your text is included, guys. Because we bought stock from Statesman Stationery and they have charged us a tax, guys. That's why we need to include not exclude tax guys but include tax guys which is how much standard rate tax guys 15 percent and you close this guys then you go back to the question paper okay question paper says okay cool you're gonna use this as your reference guys ss14 because this is an invoice number date is 1407 2018 guys okay cool one step at a time let me know uh, okay, cool. Remember, we're doing period what is period one. I think it's period one. Period one, as you can see, it's period one. Make sure your code is correct. Open here and click your the relevant period. It's period one. The date is 14. Uh, it's 14, sorry, 14 or what? 1407 2018. 07 2018. Okay, cool. Uh, the account, guys. Okay, cool. Let me see. The account says two display cabinets, guys. Two display cabinet. Cabinet. What is, what is cabinet, guys? It can be a desk cabinet, guys. Which is equipment, guys. Display cabinet. It is equipment, guys. Very tricky this one. It's very tricky this one, guys. Okay, statesman. This is the name of the supplier. Okay, reference like I've said, we're gonna use SS14. SS14. Okay, okay, you're gonna write uh, how many? It's two. Display. You type, guys, ne? Display cabinet. Uh, it what? At uh, 3.5 H. You write as it is, guys. 3.5 H. And first step the amount is how much you see is 7,000. You write 7,000. Tap. Okay, under contra account, guys, ne? you gonna link this to the right contra account, guys. Display cabinet is equipment, guys. So here under contra account, you're gonna look for equipment, guys. Equipment, office equipment you can be written as that. Office equipment at cost. So, yeah, we we'll go to the next one. The date won't change, guys. The account won't change, guys, because we bought under the same. What? 
same same uh, supplier the reference will change with the same thing guys so that's number two is what 10 files at 50 run each 10 files at 50 run each for what for office for office use but use okay it's how much is 500 files is the uh, files is what is stationary files stationary please guys please 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 i beg i beg i beg go learn go teach yourself your accounts guys please it's very easy if you know your account guys it's very simple guys you just link to the right account guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to subscribe okay cool founders okay, cool number three Plus S fourteen. This is still the same invoice number. How many? Uh, we have five packet packaging bags. Five hundred. Bags. And how much? And two hundred fifty each. One thousand one hundred and fifty. One thousand two hundred and fifty. Uh packaging packs we still under stationary. Okay. As you can see guys, this is the amount of our supplies channel. Make sure to go to this one on the question paper. If it is correct, you can just print this supplies invoice guys supplies channel so supplies you just have to print it guys with contra with contra okay i'm gonna print this to pdf guys let me see, let me see the printer do i do okay. I can't, I'm, 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 I'm unable to set the printer to the screen. Okay, click. Uh, okay, cool. We're gonna print this to a PDF, so I'll show you how it would look, guys. It's very simple to do this, guys. These are easy. These are, are easy marks, guys. To be honest, are easy marks. Don't panic. Do not panic, guys. Everything is just straightforward. Uh, let me see where is it I guess, yeah okay cool there is it let me open it guys so you can be able to see this is what they were looking for guys the suppliers channel this is what they're looking for guys okay okay we can close this one okay We're done with this one, guys. Okay, cool. Ah, okay. I've made a mistake, but anyway, you can also go back where we were. For sales channels. Cool. How do you see the returns of this invoice, guys? Under your returns, guys. If you can see the name of the supplier, just know this are your returns. Is us making a return to things statement stationary guys okay let's check okay, no 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 okay six returns to the supplier guys as you can see on 22 07 2018 there were returns of 20 bags guys wrong size which is we bought how many 
500 bags guys but now we need to return 20 bags wrong size okay note of the guys write this down it's 250 down guys because when you're doing your return guys you need to include your amount and the amount you don't have it which is you're gonna take this 250 times it by 20 then you get the amount guys of 20 bags guys of 20 bags guys okay let's do our returns i'm gonna go open supplier supplies allowances bear in mind when you processing your journals guys make sure your tax is activated tax activated inclusive guys make sure uh inclusive shop cool that's delete line okay period one twenty two oh seven the date twenty what twenty eighteen I think first tab find the state statesman stationary okay cool original invoice guys as well let me see what invoice what s s fourteen s s fourteen that's our reference retain how many twenty packaging bags bags like i've said how many at, at what at 250 each guys you can also include that one at 250 each. Then you're gonna say 250 times 20 is how much? 250 times 20. That's 50 rand. Remember the contact you use when you're creating your uh your what's this your supplies you know guys still use it here and when you're done just have to print this thing guys you're gonna appear one line guys it's gonna be like this this is your suppliers allowances J now guys let's see how many marks okay it's six marks already you have your 10 that's 18 guys right it's easy to pass this already you have your 10 for general general balances plus 8 for inventory guys which you have 18 right plus your supplies invoices guys plus another 18 that's 30 six guys plus another eight that's 44 of david notes guys plus another 31 marks that's 75 marks guys already plus six marks you have 81 marks guys okay let's process you have your 10 for your suppliers channel and your six for suppliers allowances general guys which is you have your 97 guys if you can take that 97 divided by 200 guys times 100 percent you have your 48 percent guys already you passed this exam guys but anyway we want to pass with how many 60 above guys 60 above okay 60 above i'm done with this one guys the next video i'm gonna show you how to print how to how to print let's say a supply on your system guys if they say like this 14.7 guys I'm gonna show you how to print this guys okay, thanks for tuning in guys please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell